Hello guys, what up? In today's video, I'll be talking about a new software from Magix called Vegas Image. And in my previous video, I talked about Vegas Effect and how it benefits to Vegas Pro Editor where you can send any clip in Vegas Pro to Vegas Effect for more advanced um, compositing editing. Now in this video, I'll be covering on Vegas Image. And Vegas Image essentially is the same software. They just rebranded from a software called Image Pro or Image Pro, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, but the same software, same like Vegas Effects, they just rebrand the Hipfilm Pro uh, compositor software. So here Vegas Image is, I would say it's like a two-in-one software where you have the ability to do a manipulation edit like Photoshop and do some really nice color grading like Adobe Lightroom in this one complete package of software called Vegas image here so um, in this video I'll be going through the user interface the basic on how to use it it's pretty much simple once you you know how to use it it's very similar to uh, Photoshop and Lightroom right so you can create a new document by press the new and you can pick a various amount of template that you can choose but for this video, I'm gonna open up and uh, import an image uh, from a drone shot that I've took recently. So uh, let's go through the interface quickly. And the top section here, this is the toolbars where you can you know click this to move around the canvas or click this icon to do its, um, editing adjustment on the picture itself or some alignment and on the very right section here you got two panels the first panel here this is where you you know go through your layers your text your adjustment layer and if you click that layer you'll uh, basically see the layer property itself all right so it's pretty basic now in Photoshop you have the ability to convert your layer into smart objects so whatever edits you do is non-destructive but uh, let's just say if I add an effect here by press this plus icon and let's just say I add this Gaussian blur um, I can always undo that by click delete the Gaussian blur and it will revert back uh, the edits and I think it will not destruct your photo or you can add adjustment layer by press this icon here and you look at the adjustment layer and you can apply any effect straight into the adjustment layer. So um, it's a bit different how you do uh, editing in Vegas image. So let's just say this is our adjustment layer and you can add a few uh, effects here. So for example, you can add blur effect or coloring effect color correction details distort and generate some more uh, stuff here everything is under uh, effect tabs if you want to do some masking you have this mask icon so let's just say we want to mask out portion of this picture you click the picture layer and on this mask you press plus and click the vector now vector is something similar to a pen tool in Photoshop so we're gonna create our first point here and then just do some simple masking and close the mask and it'll make the mask shape um, that we have uh, created here and you can add more softness on the edge or reduce it to zero and play around with the opacity and you can always again delete the mask if you wish to now let's go back to adjustment layer and I did say that the Vegas image is um, have the ability to color your picture like Lightroom so on the effects I'm gonna add a color adjustment and I'm surprised how powerful the color adjustment effect here so you can select the amount of range that will affect in your photo so you can toggle view selections and let's pick the trees so here we are pretty much know that the white preview here showing that all the trees here are pretty much selected and if you go to here you can change the color of the tree 
if you want to and you can play around the lightness and stuff like that pretty cool and you can add more effects like um, uh, the haze that something that you see in a lightroom and you can do more uh, the haze into your image straight away pretty cool and you can toggle on and off for the adjustment layer now adding text is a bit different you press this text icon and you, you basically write the text on the content here again everything is must be done in the in this right side uh, portion of your uh, in, in Vegas image so I'm not sure if you can or you can't edit straight away in the preview but the only way I found is to write the the things here in this content section and you can also resize the font and you can move around the text if you like like so right so that's how you add tags in Vegas uh, image. It's pretty simple, straightforward. And I might do a tutorial for this um, software. Personally, in my opinion, I'm not really um, well known on using this software because I'm more familiar with Photoshop and Lightroom. But after I give it a try uh, before this, before making this video, it's pretty much the same. It's just that the way you apply that specific stuff uh, in Vegas image is different like how you do it in Photoshop or in Lightroom so yeah this is the basically a uh, brief overview on Vegas image and I might do a tutorial on how to use this program and uh, yeah thank you guys for watching and see you guys on my next video Bye -bye.